<laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? You asshole! Ugh. That wasn't on purpose, by the way. Of course it wasn't. Okay, pirate, stop raping me! But that was on purpose. God damn it. What? The pirate was raping me because of you! <laughs> anyway, hey guys, welcome back to our Let's Play of Metroid Prime with your host, the MJ406. Hey, a special guest. Yes, uh, sorry about the random uh, rapage there, but I got distracted. But I promise not to make that happen again. Alright. You dumbass. Alright, it's been a while since I've been on this game, so I have to try to remember where we are. I think last time we got the power bomb and the grapple beam. So next we'll be going for, um... The power up we don't really need, but it's helpful to have anyway. Actually, okay. you might remember what I mean, Coda. Uh, I don't honestly, because I don't have the guide up, but I can pull it up. I'll give you a hint. A hint. Apparently, you told me it was like a, a Simpsons reference. It does nothing. Right, right, right. An old Simpsons reference too. That's the thing. Yeah, I don't, I don't even remember it, unfortunately. I'm a huge Simpsons fan. <sighs> like, the fact I don't remember it makes me disappointed. Uh, I don't remember. Hmm. No, I'm honestly intrigued to kind of get a power up, another kind of upgrade before I get the upgrade I'm about to get. Just to confuse the hell out of everybody. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, did you ever get approved for having videos longer than 15 minutes, or no? Not yet. Okay, so to play it safe, we'll still stay at the 15 minute mark. Yeah. Alright, well, I decided I'm gonna cheat for this power-up, because for you guys that have no idea what the fuck I just did, because it looks like I just landed on an invisible platform. As you can tell by these raindrops, if you can see them, they're just stopping in midair. I'll show you why that's happening as soon as I get over into the next room. So yeah, what the hell happened just there? Yeah, and my computer's being a dick right now, so I can't pull it up. Uh. Well, you're coming in fine, at least, so your commentary's here. Yay! Yay! Woohoo, I made it up! Let's get another missile expansion while we're at it. Let me see. Uh, I don't know the exact number of missile expansions I'm at now. Um, Okay, I'm at 30 missile expansions? The fuck? Don't worry, we still got like 19 more to go. Alright, well, here's okay, the- Okay, because the thing is, I just watched the the latest episode you posted, so I was a little confused, because yeah. I forgot how far we got into the game. Yeah, well, now we just got the X-Ray Visor. Oh, yeah, that's the thing. That's what it was. Yep, see? This was for the Thermal Visor. Now we have an extra one for the X-Ray Visor. See how I can see through this wall? But, oh, wait, there's a wall here. What the hell? Large trace magnesium detected. Drop the power bomb! And there goes the entire wall. Sweet. I love the power. What? All the bombs. All the bombs. Let me just drop a four ball bomb on that. Little simple thing on the ground. And we raised a little totem pole for spinning. To the boost! And look at that! We're gonna get another Shozo artifact. Believe me, you wanna get this one right after you get the x-ray visor, because coming back to this room is annoying. I'll show you why, because getting out is the worst part. Yeah. Alright, well, we've now gotten another Shozo artifact, which is the artifact of Shozo, the 7th of 12. Alright, so we have 5 out of 12, and apparently I have 63% of the items and 90% of the scans. It's good to have an update on that. Yeah. 
Yeah, don't worry, we're gonna be getting items more frequently. Especially now that I got the power bomb. All right. I'm still trying to pull up the guide, but my computer is being a dick right now. Yeah, you work on it. Oh no! The Shozo ghosts are back again! Oh god. Can't these guys just leave me alone? They will never leave you alone! Ah, ow! I'm trying to run away! I want to get over here! So battling them is easier. Get over here. Oh yes! Remember how they turn invisible? Turn on the x-ray visor! Why does it reveal ghosts? Shouldn't it be like heat vision or something like that? Heat vision does not reveal ghosts. Apparently the x-ray visor does. That's the only confusing thing I have about it. Why does the x-ray visor give way to paranormal visions? Uh, yeah, because normally when you, like, uh, try to find something invisible, like, you use heat visors or something like that. Well, x-ray visor makes sense, too. Not as much sense in the ghost because they don't have bones! They're, they're, they're ghosts. They're random energy patterns. How is that detected by the x-ray visor? Yeah, there should be some special equipment for you to be able to see something like that. That's what my visors are for! Apparently. And now we kill those shows ago so we can finally get out of here. Good, I, I hate this room. Get back up here the way we came. Alright. Ah, uh, great. Yep, so now we got the x-ray visor, so... Get ready for more power up hunting! Joy. Oh yeah, see these raindrops like I said? Turn on the x-ray visor. Look at that, there's actually a platform there! Hey! Alright. Yes, the x-ray visor now. reveals hidden platforms. Basically, the x-ray visor in this game is your Invisivision. If that makes any sense to you guys. I'm sure it does in some sense. You can see things that are invisible. Uh, okay. Makes enough sense to me. You really don't need this visor to get through the game, but it's very useful for getting past. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Never mind. You do need it. I forgot. There's a boss. You do need it. Yeah, that's right. You can't hurt him without the x-ray visor. Forgot about that. We'll get to that later. Um. Um. Okay. Where the hell am I going? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, power up hunting. Hunting, right. Alright, we're gonna go back through Shows of Ruins and get almost all the power ups left in here. Now, there's a lot I couldn't get earlier. We'll take a shortcut to get back to the next one. Ugh. Oh, yes. At this point of the game, the Shows of Ruins. Shozo Ghost up here in every goddamn room. The x-ray visor is helpful, but they're still a pain in the ass to deal with. Because they have a lot more health than your average enemy. Oh wow, it took care of one like that. Alright. See that? I can see the um uh maybe, let me show it again. Okay. Like oh god damn it ghost. See how there's like a hole in here? But when I go out of the x-ray visor, it's not there. Power bomb, baby! Oh, look at that! It's a half pipe out of the... Uh, nowhere? Alright. You know what? Time for some challenge mode shit. I'm gonna try to get this power up while the Shozo Ghost is attacking me. Ow! Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I give up! I hate you! I hate you! I hate you! Yes, notice how the x-ray visor shows only things in, uh, white and black. I guess you could say those are kind of like heat properties as well. For the x-ray visor, like the warmer things tend to be white, while the colder things tend to be black. I think. Hey, ow! Ow! Dick! I want to get up on the spider ball track, you asshole! 
Ah! I can't. I can't get up. Oh my god! Let me up! Okay. Sorry for the near freak out. I'm trying to get these quickly. Apparently, it's also Peng Penguin Awareness Day today. Penguin Awareness Day? What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know. Guess when but we recorded this? Statuses are happy of Penguin Awareness Day. Guess when we played this? <laughs> Jesus. Penguin Awareness? I didn't even know they had that. I didn't know either. I wonder how many people watched March the Penguins in honor of that. I wouldn't. I I don't know. I never watched March of the Penguins. Neither did I. I really don't care for it. Neither do I. Yes! The only redeeming quality I can see for that movie is that fact that Morgan Freeman narrates it, I think. Every time I come in and explain something, I get a freckle. Oh, wait, you wouldn't get that reference. Never mind. I hope somebody gets that reference, because it was a good one. All right, let me go show off this tunnel. I didn't show this off yet. All I know, speaking of Morgan Freeman, yes? uh, someone I know on YouTube, uh, one, of the thing, like, one of the things he does is uh, draws random things. Oh, God. Did he draw something about Morgan Freeman? Uh, yes, and this was actually requested by one of his fans. Oh, nice. Uh, so what the fan requested that the guy drew was Morgan Freeman riding a unicorn while eating spaghetti. But I'd honestly be a little interested to see that. Just to see how he did it. Actually, it looks pretty good. I could probably send you the link later. Ooh, yeah, that sounds pretty cool. <laughs> Let's get this missile expansion. Probably could have gotten this with the gravity suit, but I ignored it. <laughs> uh, Morgan Freeman riding a unicorn eating spaghetti. Yes. Hmm. I like it. I haven't seen it yet, but I can only imagine how awesome it looks. It, it's done by the same guy who did the Bad Man Mario, if you remember that. <gasps> oh, that guy! Oh, okay. Ah. Nice. Yeah. And it's, no, it's not the one who did all four of them in one. It's well, the yeah, one yeah, yeah, yeah. The guy who did the original them, ones. Yeah. The guy who did the original ones, right? Yes. All right. I'd love to talk more about it, but because of our 15-minute limit, yeah, we managed to get to a save point. I want to keep going the save point system. All right. So, till next time, we'll go back to power up hunting. This is your. This has been your host, the MJ4106. And Carter, that thousand one special guest still can't get the damn guy up. Yeah, don't worry. We're gonna be power up hunting. You don't need to know about the next upgrade for the next episode or two. So, we'll see you guys next time when we go looking for more missile expansions and we'll finally get our first power bomb expansion. I think. Yay. You'll find out later.